Hi everyone and welcome to my channel again. In this episode we are going to try to uh, complete the whole SEO checklist of Wix, Wix Studio, for the template website that I'm creating for selling later on this year. If you're new here on my channel, I create videos about uh, user experience, design, web development without code, solving problems and also giving tutorials on different uh, platforms and tools. So let's start. But before we continue, please make sure you subscribe so you can get notification next time I'm uploading a video or I'm starting a stream. First thing first, we have to connect our Google profile with the Google Search Console. So every single page we have on our Wix website can be easily indexed by Google. Let's try it. But first, if you don't know where to find this, you need to go to your Wix dashboard and choose the website you want to manipulate. Then you go on your menu on the left side and find marketing and SEO and then click on the SEO. And then when you see this dashboard here, you can go down and connect to Google. As I said, when you connect with Google Search Console, it will create a personalized checklist for your site, will also set up this site for search results and submit your homepage for fast indexing. This is our brand's name. This is important for your business if it's a local business or online business. Now we stumble upon the keywords again. And let's see what are the recommendations here under. Three keywords, separate each one with a comma. Don't include your business or site name. Use a descriptive words like vintage comic book store instead of bookstore. In other words, be more specific. And see good and bad keywords examples. Good examples are online mystery bookstore, book comic book delivery shop, Spider-Man comic subscription box. Bad examples are vague and already, how to say, taken words like bookstore, kind of generic, but not really. For example, it, this here, it says that it's too generic to be searched for a potential customer. Better option would be Spider-Man comic book store. So you also include some niche word like Spider-Man inside of the comic book store. SEO in general is not a very easy thing to do, but once when you get the hang of it, it's very used to set up later on. Okay, let's start uh, with our website. What, what kind of keywords we can use for our website? Maybe handcrafted, minimalistic, handcrafted minimalistic jewelry. Um, so when I Google ethical and sustainable jewelry, there are some articles that come up and also if I correct some shops as well let's say we are um, based in Canada maybe that ethical bijuterie will actually work okay now we have two things done out of six for the home page only then we have to optimize the rest of the pages we have already 17 points done from 21 and the last one, it will be to keep building the progress. Let's see what is here. We have specific examples in the Wix checklist. For example, we have to create a clear and concise title. In the title, we have to include the keywords we used for our main website. I think that one answers the question correctly. Okay, here we have to at least one keyword include. You can provide only high quality necklaces, earrings, bracelets and accessories. Yes, that's the one we want. Now number fifth is connect this site to a custom domain, premier features. Well, this step I will leave to you guys. When you buy the template, you can do this step and connect your own domain. You can also change the name of the website. Right now it's called Jade Biju, but you can change it to anything you want. It, it can be also non jewelry and e-commerce related it can be anything you want to use as a template remember this template is just a skeleton and you can use it as a guidance and as a skeleton for your future projects so for the last task from the first step you also have to connect with uh, google search console but this one is not possible to execute if you don't have connected custom domain with premium premium future which means you have to remove the wix.com from your website name so in this 
case we're going to move to the next um, step which is optimize the site pages for search engine we need to add alt text to all images on the home page now that we can see our images let's check if each one of them has the needed alternative text how do we do that and check the alt text female profile Hand holding a golden necklace with a heart with a heart pendant. Hand model with three minimalistic rings. Single diamond necklace. Okay, that's it. I didn't talk through the process because it's self-explanatory. You just name for Google what you see on the images and make it as easy as possible for the search engine to f understand what is behind the image. After we hit publish, the checklist should be updated. Here for my uh, Native American pattern, I haven't deleted the PNG, so I'm going to remove it now. Now we are going to do the same but for the about page. Okay, the about page is done and it's marked as checked. Let's see why the home page doesn't have all the alt text recognized. Maybe we have some hidden elements that are not noticed as completed. Let's delete this element since we are not showing it on the web page. Publish and see again. Let's refresh and see. Ta-da! That was the reason. Whenever we have hidden elements, they're also attached to the home page, but not shown on the page. They actually are still part of the SEO. So make sure you either delete them or include all the old text on the, their elements as well. Add links to contact page. Yes, we haven't linked any page to the contact page. Let's do this. Now, after we have created the connection from to contact page, the checklist has to change to ready. It is. It is completed. To keep building on your SEO and other settings, you can optimize with the SEO assistant for which you have to pay, uh, which is included with the premium plan. But as you can see, we have 90% of our checklist done. These 7% that remain are connecting your domain and also submitting your pages for indexing with Google Search Console. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And soon, very soon these days, I'm planning to also create another stream where we can work on the layout of the rest of the pages. See you in the next one. Bye.